everyone welcome back to my craft room if you're new to my craft room well then welcome uh, today I am going to be working on something a little different I've been watching people uh, decorating their planners and I thought that was really great I used to do a lot of scrapbooking I haven't done it in a long time but I really enjoyed it so I hit, went to Michael's and I picked up a happy planner I got this it was on sale I don't have the receipt I don't remember exactly what it was it was on sale and I also had a coupon for 20% off uh, sale items. So I got this at a good deal and it's real pretty. It's got all kinds of neat stuff and I picked up a couple of these sheets with the pockets in them so I can put in some coupons or papers or whatever I need for that week or month. And Michaels is also, if anybody's interested, is having a another sale with the 50% off coupon for one item uh, September 5th through the 16th and then they're going to be having another 25% off your entire purchase including sale items from the 17th to the 23rd and then another 50% off a regular priced item uh, September 24th through the 30th so this is what I usually when I usually hit Michaels is when I get these good coupons and I go get something really nice I actually got my um, punch to punch out the holes for my planner I don't know where I put it right now but anyway, I got that at 50% off, so that was really great because it can get expensive doing these planners. But I had nothing to get started, so I purchased from a shop on Etsy where you print out and you cut them out yourself. And I don't have any adhesive paper. I want to get adhesive paper so I can print them out on that, cut them out, and then I can just peel and stick. But for now, I'm just going to cut these out and uh, use a glue stick, and we'll see how that works out for me. Uh, this shop was uh, called Planning Simplified, and it was only $1.50 for the entire set for the week. And it had some really pretty things. It's got a really cute autumn owl in there, and some pumpkins and acorns and such. So I thought these were really cute, and it was a really good price. Then I also printed out some of this paper, just a picture I found online, and I just of different fall colors and I also found a picture online of just some fall leaves and I'm going to cut these out for maybe a border or something I'm not quite sure yet but we're going to figure this out and I'm going to go ahead and cut all those out and then we can get started all right so I have my pages out of my planner for the week of the 11th through the 17th and I won't make you watch me do both pages because I'm going to pretty much do the same thing so we'll start out on this one I guess and then I'm just going to take some washi I think uh, I'm pretty sure this came from the Dollar Tree it's just I thought that would go with the fall colors and I'm just going to do my little lines here And I know definitely I will be getting the adhesive paper because um, it's going to be much easier than just, you know, trying to cut it all out and then have to use glue sticks. This is my handy dandy uh, washi tape ripper. It's an old gift card that I just put some um, colorful duct tape on. So I'm just going to use that to rip my washi. That works really good. I really don't have a plan for this yet. I mean, this is my very first uh, planner page that I'm doing. I kind of have an idea of what I want to do, but it could change as I'm going along here, I guess. It looks pretty. I like that. So I was just watching the news a little while ago. I guess that hurricane's going to be picking up speed again. It's heading towards Florida. And I feel really sorry for all those people down there. Hopefully, 
because most of them can get out that, you know, can go. I know some people, it's not that easy to just go, but I just have to pray for the ones that have to stay. And let's see. <clears throat> I've also never used the Dollar Tree uh, glue before, so we'll see how that works out. Okay, this is one that I cut out from that um, Planning Simplified pages that I purchased. And I'm going to put this down here on the bottom. I do need a piece of paper to put underneath. I'll just use this one because I'm not going to use that. I don't want to get glue all over my thing here. So I'm just going to glue this one down on the bottom. Definitely getting the adhesive paper. I mean, this isn't too bad. I mean, it's fine. It'll, you know, work just fine. We'll see. I don't know. If this isn't too bad, I may not use the adhesive paper. Alright, I want to put some of these in here. Mm, I thought these are really pretty. It's still going to leave a little space. I may need to put something else. Well, we're going to put that on there first and then see. And then September 11th is coming up, which is actually my husband's birthday. It's September 11th. We all have horrible birthdays. This is September 11th, which was a not very good date. I was born on Friday the 13th and I have a grandson who was born 6606 so yeah we have some pretty horrible birthdays but it's okay. And I have one grandson this month who will be turning 16 yeah, I cut those out a little bit too small. Well, we'll figure this out. Um, so he'll be wanting to learn how to drive. And that's always a scary thing. Oh, I wanted to put... No, what did I want to do with this? I cut this out for a reason. I don't know, but I think I'm going to put this... Hmm, I did have a plan. Oh, here it is. Is this what I was going to use? Yeah, I'm going to put these acorns up there. But they're cute. And then when I finish this, I want to I have a cute little um, fall decoration idea I want to get done today, hopefully. Yeah, that's cute. And um, I actually have a couple of ideas. I have so many ideas going around my brain that sometimes I just can't even get one done. Alright, now I cut out these leaves and I think I want to put these on the edges. I think that's what I'm going to do. I really like that. Oh, this was just that, um, I don't even know where the rest of it is. Just that leaf um, picture that I printed out online. So I think I'm going to put that along the edge. Turn this around so I can see the line. leaves. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this glue stick. Maybe I'm just not putting enough on. I don't know. And just a dab up here. Yeah, that's cute. 
All right, let's see if we can rip this with the my handy dandy gift card. That's not too bad. But I do want to go. I haven't been to the store around here called Ollie's. Um, we say they have good stuff cheap. That didn't look too good. I think the next one I'm going to use the scissors. And um, I want to see what kind of things that they have. I mean, I really enjoy doing this, but I kind of want to, you know, keep it in a budget. All right, my lines are awful there. No? All right. Let's see. This little guy here. Cut him off. You need your handy dandy paper cutter. I don't know what I would do without this thing. decorating season already. I don't know where the summer went. It always seems to go by so fast. My husband was outside yesterday actually cutting wood to use in our wood stove because we pretty much rely on that all winter. Um, I don't want that there. Actually our wood stove is downstairs and we have a ranch style home and the wood stove is in the basement so it pretty much heats the entire house and we actually haven't bought any fuel I don't think in five years because he's real good about you know keeping up the wood stove going alright now let's see oh, that one's pretty, put that one over there So yeah, he was outside all day yesterday, cutting wood and stacking it up down in our, we have a greenhouse, we don't use it as a greenhouse, we use it as a place to store our wood, but that's pretty much filled up so we should be good for the winter. Alright, that looks cute. I do think I want to put some washi down the sides here. I don't know if I want to use the same. Yeah, why not? <clears throat> Maybe we'll just run it all the way up. Hoping you can see what I'm doing here. Um, yeah, so I don't really have a lot going on this week. I decided I wanted to get into doing the planner just so I can keep myself a little more organized. You know, we always have appointments and I put the file, the little folders in there that you can keep papers in and stuff. I figured that would keep all our doctor's appointments or whatever else we have going on. We can just keep all our paperwork in there until it's ready to go. And so hopefully I keep up with this. They do really like it. It's very relaxing. Alright, so I think this is all the decorating part I'm going to do besides the stickers and things I want to add to this. So if anybody knows
knows where to get some, you know, inexpensive um, planning, you know, stickers and things or whatever. I mean, I'm new at this. I have not a clue. So, just leave me a message in the comments below if you have any suggestions. That would be greatly appreciated. Ugh. I'm too short. It's fine. And one more here. I love this stuff because you the stuff you can really reposition it and you're not really you know stuck if you put it on there a little wrong. that's it for this page. I'm going to go ahead and put all of this on my other page and I won't make you watch me do all that and then I will come back. All right, I have my two pages all decorated up here. I think it's coming out pretty good for my first attempt. Um, I'm just going to put on some of these little to-do list stickers here and add them in. kids next door outside playing. It's a beautiful day here so far. Oh, let's see. I'm just going to add a couple of these. I really don't have that much to do this week. Which is a good thing. I do want to get my other video out. I have two more videos coming up of fall decorating. And then I'm going to be working on another wedding centerpiece. There's just some times where I just get completely craft blocked. Where I just don't have a clue. So it may take me a couple days to get things out, but... Yeah, definitely want to get the adhesive paper because this is kind of a pain in the butt. Got a lot of yard work I want to get done this next coming week. I need to get some shrubs cut and things so they're all ready for the fall. All right, I'm going to put my little planner thing, because I really want to do these on Fridays. So I'll stick my little plan here to remind me to do this next Friday. And let's see, I have this cute little sticker. This came in one of those um, sticker pads from the Dollar Tree that I'm going to put on my husband's birthday, which is Monday doesn't really go with my theme here, but that's all right. It's his special day. Uh, let's see. My little mail sticker. I try to go and check my post office box every Wednesday. And I do love friend mail, so anyone interested in friend mail, I would be so happy to get something in the mail. Besides the usual bills and whatnot. <laughs> but I think that's everyone. Oh, here I need to put my little weekend sticker. Yay for the weekend. Yeah, I'm not crazy about this Dollar Tree glue stick. At all. I mean, they work okay. And once it's glued down, they really do stick very well. And then I just took, I have a, um, 
just a little one inch punch and I punched out some of the little decorative pieces instead of trying to cut these out I don't even know how I would get those cut out so I'm just going to stick a few of these in here They're cute. Well, I'm really pleased with this. I, I wasn't quite sure what I was going to do, but I guess as you go along, you kind of figure it out. And I think it's coming out lovely. What else we got? Ah, oh, my little garbage can. I need to put him on here. Our garbage comes on Mondays. And I just have a couple more of these and we're done. Actually, this I put in the wrong spot. I wanted it here, but I guess I was rushing and not paying attention. It really did glue down, so I couldn't even get it back off. But that's okay. All right. One more of these cute little stickers up here. And that's it. Now I just need to use my handy dandy hole punch here. I got this at Michael's. I got the large one because I also had a large planner that I purchased that I'm going to be using for my keep track of my YouTube stuff. But this is great because it has it marked for you know both size planners. Which is great. So you don't need two separate ones. <clears throat> Alrighty, let's put this back in our planner. I'm going to do a couple more things I need to write on here, but I can do that later. And that's just so easy peasy. All right, I'm going to take this um, camera off of here and we'll get a shot of this. And that will be it. All right, there is my finished planner week. I think it came out really cute for my first attempt. Um, I thought this was fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, at least doing this, I have a little time to chit chat and tell you what's going on in my life. Um, so. We'll try to do this again next week and you know I'll keep my regular other crafting videos up this will just be a little extra so thanks for watching everybody have a great day